here's the aqua view all right this thing is pretty awesome it doesn't have LED lights on it and here is the LED DVR camera I, it's kind of funky because the light in here but what I'm there's the Garmin all right but what I really like is this this is my 14 inch portable monitor that I got plugged in to the AquaView and uh, I can really see great on this thing uh, man there's the weeds right at the bottom and the water right above it and this is pretty awesome my setup is awesome I can't believe I'm fishing with so many electronics but uh, it is what it is and it's all about getting the best footage that I can bring to you for the show all right everybody welcome to Rockstar Fishing the special episode epic underwater cam fish strikes and behavior so uh, last ice we were up in Harrison Long Lake got the underwater cameras going and we placed it over tip up and we ran it for the whole day all this footage comes uh, courtesy of Bill Christie now uh, we got some bass and walleye coming in here in the first couple clips we'll show you and uh, you can see you know head first and uh, got felt the hook and spit and bum me out so but that's what we're going to talk about today so what we're going to learn through all these clips I'm going to show you and present to you today and all the fish behavior might change the way you think about approaching stuff because it surely changed the way that I look about approaching stuff. So uh, the, we're going to wait for the bass to get out of here. The pike's coming. Just wait till you see these pike clips. But uh, this tip-up's just hanging. We have a yellow daredevil on there and a pretty big treble hook, you know, and just hanging out. They're just lurking around underneath. A lot of looking for the bass and walleye, um, you know. But uh, what I'm going to get to here is the pike. So northern pike, they're either a stealth come in look 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 and hit it or it's like a freight train coming in I have both clips or a few clips of stuff like that but uh see look at that got it in his mouth pulling on it but he felt some resistance no oh, oh come on what you gonna do here no all right this is a little perch right here watch this this is kind of cool so he's hitting on the big chub almost <laughs> as soon as he felt resistance but you see he's back down in the corner now here we go so this is freight train you ready watch this Oh man, that was epic. Alright, so watch what happens. He's fighting with it. Fighting with it. And he let it go. The flag didn't go off. There's slow mo for you. Now, the flag didn't go off. What are we learning? Well, we learned that that fish was down there messing with that thing. We didn't know about it and we didn't see it. Look at this one. Here's Stealth. Alright, coming in. Coming in. Watch this. This is the stuff we don't get to see while we're just sitting up on top of the ice, enjoying the day, enjoying the weather, talk to our buddies. You know, the cameras have really, really changed. So, but what we're gonna talk about coming up is this. Now see, it's in his mouth, head first. What I learned is every single strike that a pike does is head first on the chub. Look at this. Look at that. All that action. Look at that, knocking the camera around. And then what happened? He let it, well, I don't know if he caught that one, but this one right here. So what I'm getting at is all these fish came in, all these fish hit our stuff, and we didn't know it. And it's all head first. So what am I learning from this? I'm learning. See that? Just spit it right out as soon as he felt the hook. I'm learning that I'm going to take a lure, and I'm going to put a stinger hook on it, and I'm going to run it to the front of the mouth of the chub. And from now on, I don't even think I'm going to fish with the tip up. I think I'm going to switch over to like stuff like the HT Ice Rigger, where you can set the sensitivity on the rod, and it'll set that hook. Because if I had that hook, that rod in my hand, and these fish, and I was watching the camera and seeing them come in, I would have had almost every one of these when I had it in his mouth. I would have pulled up and, and, and set the hook. So I've learned a lot. I hope you are too out of all this footage that these pike. It, you know they want to come in and get it but when they feel something they're good they're spitting out I missed literally 20 northern pike this day and you've seen a whole bunch of them right here so the you know the stealth mode they're stalking 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 man but when you're sitting up and looking at this and watching this you get so excited you know so uh, this is Long Lake up in Harrison and I mean the epic action in this lake head first once again look at him look in his mouth completely completely didn't set the flag off. Man, that's what I'm saying. All this action is going on in the water. We don't know what's going on. You don't know what's going on. But now the camera has showed us what's going on. And now we have to learn from this. Look at all these fish that I would have had that they just keep spitting it out. And this is just on a tip up. And not one flat on all these hits. That's the amazing part. Not one flag. 
so um you know thank you for checking this out um i really appreciate you know everybody checking out my episodes and all this and Rockstar Fishing is something I've been working on for four years now. I've traveled all over the state. I'm up to 20 episodes. I've learned a lot about fishing and filming and making a show and making it better. And it seems like every episode that I make, you know, we're working on getting it better and better. And now we got the cameras. Look at, look at this. Look at this. See the, the tip-up line? He didn't. The flag didn't go off. Not yet. Unless this is one of the ones we caught. Nope, look at it, there it goes. All that action, flag didn't go off. <laughs> yeah, so, but once again, thanks everybody. Please like and subscribe. And what's coming up is uh, lots more shows, lots more footage. We're going to start doing split screen above and below. And, um, you know, all the great music that we have on the show. I appreciate everybody for checking out the band Mind Drought and stuff. And all our new sponsors and everything. And the show's building. Go Pure Michigan, go Lions. And, uh... I hope everybody has learned from this footage, like that I have, about the epic underwater uh, behavior of a pike. I mean, that's my favorite fish. Oh, look at this. All right, so we got a bass comes in. Bass is going to hit it, mouth it. As soon as he feels the hook, he's going to spit it out. <laughs> and it, man, just getting all this stuff showing me that what we're doing. Look, here's a pike lurking in the background. Now he wants it. Just in the bass's mouth, now it's going to be in the pike's mouth. Yeah, there's a lot of fish in this lake, and uh, oh, see, once again, just spitting it. So learn from this like I did. Thank you, Rockstar Fishing. <laughs>